Today, I'm going to take you out into the rain, into a nice, warm, summer rain. Getting back to nature is so important. And even if we can't stand naked during a rainstorm or under a waterfall, we can go there in our minds. Allow me to lead you there. I'm your guide, and I am your friend. Let's begin. Take a big, deep breath. Allow the oxygen to fill every cell in your body. And allow all tension to fall away. See yourself walking along a forest path. No one is around for miles. You walk through the trees, feeling the cool summer rain on your skin. You're dressed in shorts and a tank. Soon you come to a clearing and knowing that no one is around, you begin to get undressed. Breathe deeply. Remove your shoes first. Or slip off your sandals. And stand there breathing deeply. And allow that rain to wash over you. Feel the energy coming up from the forest floor. Allow the energy of Mother Earth penetrate the soles of your feet, feel it climbing, climbing up through your legs, up through your hips, up, up through your torso, up to your shoulders, down your arms to your fingers, and then back up to your neck. Feel the energy of Mother Earth flood your face and your head with every deep breath you take. Now, slowly remove the rest of your clothing. There is a rock there near you that is perfectly dry. There is a natural shelter of thick branches over it. You place your clothing there. You can get fully naked if you're comfortable. If not, you can leave on your underwear. What you want to accomplish during this meditation is a union with nature, an experience with the life-giving water that our atmosphere sheds and that every living being needs to survive. Stand there with your feet comfortably apart, arms loose by your side, hands and fingers gently resting. Continue breathing deeply and feel every cell fill with fresh oxygen. You're standing in a clearing where the rain is coming down quite heavily. You can look up into the rain, watch it fall, watch it hit the leaves. Feel it land on your head and trickle down your skull weaving itself through your hair and along your scalp, down the back, and then feel it trickle down the back and sides of your neck. Feel it wash down over your forehead, off your eyebrows, onto your cheeks. Feel the raindrop slide down your nose and off the end. Feel these drain drops drenching you. 
Feel your skin absorbing its moisture and its nutrients. Feel how the drops continue to slide down your body, hitting your shoulders and sliding down your back, through your shoulder blades, down, down, to the curve of your lower back and around your bottom. Feel how these raindrops slide down your arms, weaving their way around your muscles until they slide down over your wrists and down off the end of your knuckles of your fingers. Feel how the drops slide down your torso, hitting your chest and sliding down over your breasts along your rib cage and down your stomach. Feel how these drops find their way into the groove of your groin, along your hips, down your thighs. Feel how they splash against your skin. A small splash with every drop until the water continues down your legs along your lower legs and down off your ankles and heels. Feel it slide down the front of your feet and between your toes and down into Mother Earth. Feel how you are connected to all the elements of Earth. The ground itself, water, breathing in the air and the fire and passion of your own spirit coming alive. Find this place within yourself. If you cannot always find it in nature itself, find this place in your imagination. Anchor it in your own subconscious so that you can call it up to your conscious mind at any time. Wiggle your toes in that wet earth. Slide the palms of your hands over your wet body. Taste the pure rainwater on your tongue. Notice how it differs from tap water or bottled water. It does somehow taste fresher and sweeter. This belongs to you. All of this. It is your birthright. The water, the earth, the air. It cleanses you and sustains you. And it is your right to have it free, fresh, and clean. Now, look to your left and you will see a nice, fluffy, soft, dry towel on a stone waiting for you. Gently dry yourself off. You can scrub a little bit in some places to invigorate yourself stimulating the skin, encouraging the blood flow to come up to the surface even more. Appreciate your healthy, wonderful body in which you experience life in this moment, in this natural environment, drenched in Mother Nature's water. Now it's time to get dressed again. Slowly putting back on your clothes one piece at a time. And the last thing are your shoes or sandals that you slip back on. Shake your hands, shake your feet gently. Allow all that energy you've collected and all that water that is now absorbing into your skin. Allow the energy of that to move completely through your body, through all the joints, 
right out through the tips of your fingers and the ends of your toes. You can now return to the forest path and walk back to where you came from, knowing that you have collected much energy from Mother Earth as she is here for her creatures, her children, one of which is you. This is a magnificent planet and it is yours for your survival and pleasure. Take the magnificence of this rainwater walk deep inside yourself and do whatever you can to keep this alive, free, fresh, and clean. Let it be so.